Hi, this is Pat Love with Pat's Two Cents. I know we're entering the Christmas season, and I also realize that many of you are going to deal with a lot of loneliness, the feeling of loss. There'll be that empty void because someone either passed away or you have a broken relationship. Sometimes it's very difficult to go through the Christmas holidays when that's the time of the crisis, that's the time of the trauma, of the tragedy, of the loss. And we don't really always feel like celebrating God when most of us blame God for taking our loved ones. Most of us blame God for allowing us to be hurt. Well, all I want to say to you is, if you're hurting right now, I'm not even dealing with the blaming God part. If you're hurting during this season, ask God to ease the pain, take it away. Ask God to heal those old emotions that come rising to the surface, troubling you on a daily basis. Ask God to remove the anger that comes with the hurt, to remove the resentments. Listen, God knows why you're hurting. God knows what you're going through. And he is really waiting with bated breath to heal those hurts. But tragically, I can't believe how many people won't ask him to take the hurts out, to take all that hurt away and replace it with peace and joy. God's presence is, is so wonderful. It's so There's so much healing in his presence. And I mean permanent healing. You can remember and not feel the pain. That's one of the meanings of the scripture that says, Death, where is thy sting? Grave, where is thy victory? Yeah. Even though there are losses in your life, even though there are painful moments, does not mean you have to feel the pain for years and years and years and years. God heals you guys. God heals the broken in heart. He came to set the captives free. He came, all those stripes on his back. He said himself, I came to heal the brokenhearted, to, to mend the bruise, to free the captives. Ugh. If you only knew what pleasure it gave God to go in your your painful basement of rattling skeletons and boogeymen and clear all that out for you. God wants to heal you. God wants you to be happy. God wants you to be fulfilled and satisfied. Please go to him. Please seek his face. Second Chronicles seven fourteen says, if my people who are called by my name would humble themselves and pray and seek my face and turn from their wicked ways. Then will I hear from heaven, forgive their sins, and will heal their land. Everything about your life will be healed. Just give him a try. Give him a chance. See what he'll do. God bless you. And have a wonderful Merry Christmas and a blessed New Year.